welcome to Ethan's videos. Today we're going to um, learn how to make a necklace. Um, um, necklace. These are your necklaces. They get, first. So first you get this yarn and that's mine. or string. Oh, hey, get off my video. She's going to just help. It's okay. I'm Tie one to the end. Tie one to the end. All right, here you go. Okay, Parker, he's going to do it. He wants okay, to Ethan. do a video. Ready? All right, it's all you, dude. Tell me when you're done. Well, I, I want to get she out has, of she's the Ethan. Mom, can I use this one? You okay. can do that one later. He's going to do it right now. He doesn't okay. want you on this video. Thank you. All right, so tell them what they do. Here you go. So I get some string and then get a loop loop. And then with I ideas, do it with Cheerios. You can do it, you can do it with Cheerios that have these tiny holes. Yeah, you the guys that have tiny holes. Sorry. Is it working, buddy? Sometimes it can be a little hard with thicker string, huh? So let's tell them a hack that we have. If you only have thicker yarn, you can pull apart or ask your parent and you can just pull out one of the strings of the yarn, just like that. And then it will be thinner for younger kids to work with because sometimes it's hard to thread them without peeling the rest of the yarn. So let's go ahead and start this one, buddy. See if this one's a little bit easier. Mom, I can't get this loop loop in. We'll try it on this one. I made you a smaller string. And I can try to make this one a smaller string as well. And tell him if you think that is easier string to use. This is easier string. Okay, just get this tiny little thing. Got it, guys? Okay. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Okay. Okay. Let's get this one in and pull it out. Right, Mom? Right. Great work, good fine motor activity. Yeah, this is a great school work. Great school work. Are you using your pincher grasp? Pincher grasp? Yep. To hold the string. Yeah. And then you're threading or lacing. And then what are you gonna do with, when you're all done with your necklace? Hang, hang it on my neck. Hang it on your neck? And then are you just going to leave it just like that? Yeah. Or are you going to eat it? Eat it. <laughs> ask, ask me, I'm not going to eat it. I'm just going to eat these pretzels. Oh, he really wants to have some goldfish pretzels. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Okay, guys. So over here, I'm just peeling off more string for him to use later. Yeah. Here's a big one. Sometimes this is. <laughs> that one was the two daggers, so I couldn't find way to put it in, so I just eat it. Okay. Sometimes you'll lose some of them to snacking, but that's the fun of it. So, what I would do is have them wash their hands before getting started. Because and if you have more than one child or a daycare with 
kids from multiple families and you're wanting to keep the germs separate, I would give them each their own little container. Um, if you want to make it more challenging for older kids, I would ask them, like kindergarten, first grade, I would ask them to use the colors to make a pattern. A, B, A, B, or A, A, B, A, A, B, B. Or Parker says make sure that they have a hundred on their necklace so you can have them use it for counting. When I was doing um, 20 hundredth day of school, I... 20 hundredth is not a word, honey. Hundred? Yeah. One hundred? No, no, it wasn't one hundred. One hundred and twenty. One hundred and twenty day of school. Um, we had to make a necklace with cereal up to one hundred and... Twenty. Twenty. And... Usually we just make this with what we have around the house, but if we had Cheerios, we would do a separate bowl of Cheerios. That way they could do a pattern that way. Yeah. Good job, Ethan. You're Looking getting good. longer. Yep. Parker's going to go ahead and do one on the screen. Oh, want me to tie one on the end, or do you want to tie one on the end? Uh, I'll do that. Those are all for me. Um, why would they all be for you? Sometimes you guys share, okay, buddy? She would like to make one. I'm making more right here. Look. She's making even more. You just haven't, for you. You haven't finished your first one yet. Yeah, you so haven't finished. Look at this. He's really fat. It's really yeah, fat. but you can't put that in. You just have to eat it. She could put it in if she'd like to try. It's just a double stack fruit loop. And it could it it could be like the Why beginning. don't you grab a chair, Parker, or sit on your knees because they can't see you. Um oh, sorry. All right, buddy, are you going to finish up? We're going to end this video soon, so put a few more on there so we can show them what it looks like when you're all done. There we go. If you recognize me, I'm from one of my videos. That's PK. I'm, yeah, what? Parker, my my sister. Big mm -hmm. sister. I'm being a yeah. big sister. Yeah. Sometimes when I was a baby, she um, tried to do good things. To me, um, help me, tease me to walk. Yeah, we were trying to get you to walk. Yeah, and she was teaching me how to go potty in the bathroom. Okay. <laughs> so, what do you guys think about doing school at home? Why don't you tell them your thoughts on that? Um, what What's the good things? What's the not well, so good things? Well, I don't really like to not be with my friends. That's what I really like about school. Yeah. Mom, since this like yarn is a little bit frizzy, can you cut it, please? It's a little frizzy. Actually, I'll just go do it. I can do that. All right. Can't put is in. it getting a little frizzy? Sometimes that happens, and like Parker said, you could trim the end. You could hey, man, use it. Yarn. Yeah, our cat's trying to get our yarn. Oh, well. You could just twist it to make it a sharper point again. If you have um, like that stretchy type of string string that's yeah, that made would be for really making good. necklaces, that is really a good one to work with because it's not so hard for their yeah. little chubby fingers to thread on the cereal. Oh, yeah. And if they're eating them at the same time, their fingers can get a little sticky, which makes it a little um. difficult as well. Our cat is getting our thread down here. All right, so tell your friends if you think they should try this. Yeah, it's... Justin and Kayan, right. I bet you like this video. Yeah. Yep, tell them what, what materials do they need, Ethan? Did you tell them that already? Oh, he has to tell them. I know, just kidding. He's going to tell them. Yeah, I think he did tell them. Justin and Kayan, I love you. <laughs> if He misses his friends at school, too. So if, ah, the cat's getting if me. they're watching this video, he would like to say hi. <laughs> the, the light behind you guys. Okay, so once this is all done, sometimes it takes a little while. It's a nice activity. Sometimes they're focused and it's really 
a quiet activity yeah. because they're getting to eat and focus. But once it gets all situated, they might they can choose to have a lot okay, or a little. Why can't I eat it? And you would just tie it right around here. Or sometimes they want to do it as like a little bracelet, so you can tie I it want right to do here. It like a bracelet. All right, are you gonna still finish it? Yeah. So they're gonna keep working on their Fruit Loop necklaces. <laughs> are you doing great, Shay? Mm -hmm. All right, now say bye to your friends. Bye. bye. Let them know to to tell us if they make. Their own. Shall we say and you bye. can look up for more videos just like this on T's Teachable Moments. Shay, Shay we said bye too.